I won't take you to the stars. Use the metal for a boat and you won't sail too far. Stop sitting in the dark, stirring metal parts about. You will change your life forever when you figure out. The secret code, 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 Science can be tricky, it can overheat your brain. Science can be hard to chew, each bite can be a pain. Stop sitting in the dark, stirring metal parts about. You will change your life forever when you figure out. The secret code. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday Resonance, happy birthday to you. Uh, uh, Resonance? Resonance! Uh, Hurry! He fell! He's not moving! Right then, where's our patient? Here. What is this? A joke? There's no joke here. He hasn't gotten up since he fell down. But I'm not a vet, am I? <laughs> it's one thing to treat bears or rams, but this... Uh... <sighs> Well, I could give it a try, of course. Um... Oh, no! If you could stand aside, please. <coughs> hmm. Breathe in. <laughs> Breathe out. Say <laughs> ah! Well, how is he? A definite diagnosis, uh, I can't give you. But it seems to me it's just old age. So where can I find a younger doctor then? I was referring to your worm. But my resonance should be perfectly fine. He's still a youngin. <laughs> what causes us to grow old anyway? Well, if we're speaking generally, let's take, for example, well, just a house. A house? A house. Now, what do you do once <gasps> it starts getting old? Well, I suppose we would need to do a complete renovation. All the bricks would need to be changed. Exactly. We as organisms are like houses. Our bodies consist of countless tiny bricks or cells. From time to time, some of these bricks wear out and fall away. So it's not long before we fall apart. Don't worry, you're not falling apart. As soon as the old cells go, their neighbours start repairs. In science, this is called mitosis, or cell division. The division takes place in several steps. Each cell contains a nucleus so small that you can barely discern what's inside it. OK, they look like threads or something. That's how the first step of division begins. Those threads are chromosomes. A chromosome is like a giant molecule of, if I can remember correctly, deoxyribonucleic acid or DNA for sure. They contain an enormous amount of our genetic or hereditary information. Ants have the smallest number of chromosomes, just two. People have 23 pairs, but the organism with the most chromosomes is... A bear, no doubt. No, a fern. All these chromosomes have their own copies, especially for mitosis. In the second step of division, all the chromosomes line up into a chain. Then the cell stretches and each chromosome divides in half and presto, now we have two cells with their own nuclei. Inside each nucleus, every chromosome finishes building its own copies for the next division. And now we have a new cell in place of the old one. Renovations, as they say, are all done. 
We get old because our cells uh, stop dividing well, and that's how the bricks get worn out. And why do they stop dividing? I need to brush up. I should refresh my memory and check in a few books. Welcome to this wonderful place. Sooner or later, all worms come here. Or should I say, only the best ones. <laughs> like me, for example. I am the famous worm of doubt. That you haven't heard of me only makes you better. <laughs> so let's see what we have here that's so good. Take a look for yourself. It truly is a great place that you could stay in forever, don't you think? All right, let me see. Uh, what's this? How is it going? Well, if you just <laughs> let me get on with it. It's just the resonance. Uh, uh, for some reason, won't wake up for anything. Let him rest. <laughs> In sleeping, the body's processes all slow down. <laughs> he can sleep a while and have some uh, <laughs> nice worm dreams. Ha <laughs> 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 ha! <laughs> bravo, bravo, you passed the first test. Who needs such banalities? Indeed, you have a whole world of worm possibilities in front of you. Here, you can have whatever your heart desires, and even more. What about a new body? Hmm, okay, maybe not a huge difference, but what's wrong with trying out something new, right? Huh? It's a magical feeling, don't you think? Uh, don't give up on me yet, old-timer. Ha-ha! I found it! Who's the best? I'm the best! Ha-ha! <laughs> Ahem! I found the reason why our cells can't keep dividing forever. When our cells divide, it doesn't happen without any effect on the chromosomes. The thing is, at the end of each chromosome is a type of face cap which is called a telomere. These caps protect the chromosome from converging with other molecules. During mitosis and chromosome copying, the telomeres get shorter and shorter until they disappear altogether. After that, fully-fledged copying becomes impossible. The cells stop regenerating and our bodies start irreversibly aging. So, all we need to do is figure out how to extend these telomeres. That's absolutely right! Resonance. Uh, hold on and we'll fix everything really soon. <laughs> that an anti-aging elixir does not seem possible. Hey, you, don't give up just yet. We haven't tried everything after all. Barry, if Spiroscope didn't contain the answer, then that means they won't invent it for another thousand years.
Well, naturally, a new body is such a trifle. Is it really worth limiting yourself with such trivialities? You can become one with the entire universe and have eternal life in the form of mass or energy. Wait, don't, don't go there. You don't know what's waiting for you there. Maybe there's nothing there at all. You won't be able to come back. Do you understand? Don't go. Don't. Resonance? So, Barry, congratulations to you! <laughs> I mean, who could have guessed that your little worm was just waiting to give birth? <laughs> so as it turns out that Resonance is a girl? Not exactly. <laughs> he multiplies by blastogenesis. Well, then I'll be darned. Well, who's my big ear, hmm? My little resonance and telomerkins are big eaters. Eat up, eat up, you guys. And don't you even think of getting sick. <laughs> I'm not sure they actually could. <laughs> I've been carefully studying resonance's cells. He has, as it turns out, the amazing ability to regenerate. You could say <laughs> that his cells can divide eternally. Oh. It could be that the key to eternity lies in this one's cells. 